Hey guys, Sequel45 here with episode 10 of Let's Farm. So let's get right into this video. Now, as you can see, um, I'm working, trying to get Wizard Tower with that gold I have. And I'll, for the elixir, I'm trying to get my barbarians to level 6. And Dark Elixir, I'm going to try to get my Archer Queen to level 4. We're pretty close to upgrading our Wizard Tower, so let's get into our first attack. So I'm sorry about the volume thingy, my Bob. So, um, as you can see, we have some decent loot on this base. Um, pretty good amount of gold, actually, but Elixir isn't too great. Um, and we're going to do everything we can to um, steal it all, so, you know, same old, same old, just using, you know, good old Barch. And I'm, um, you know, getting that loot that uh, I've been trying to get, get. And yeah, you know, this base is not really that filled. But yeah, I've been really all over the place, you know, looking for some nice loot. And I've been farming pretty much right now around 1,850 trophies. You know, it's pretty good in my opinion. Uh, I've been getting some decent loot there. And yeah, so loot's been pretty good there. And yeah, um... The loot was amazing while well, that uh, boosting thing was up, because when Clash of Clans hit its uh, one year anniversary, the loot was unbelievable. But the loot's been pretty good, and uh, yeah, you know, I got uploading, upgrading my base, and I think that's... <laughs> well, of course, I want to upgrade my base, because, well, everyone always wants a better base. <laughs> uh, I don't have too much to talk about, so uh, I'm going to try to get that gold mine right here, and... Um, that mortar just misses them. Some of those uh, barbarians. Um, I have a question. If you, um, if you guys want me to do, I actually play a little Boom Beach. I, I really, I'm bad at it. My like headquarters like five or four. I, I'm really bad at it. If you guys want me to do a Boom Beach let's play, I'm probably gonna do it every like few days. I'll probably upload a Boom Beach let's play. If you guys would like that, then, then of course you just say it down in the comments. I know. You guys, I know I'm a Clash of Clans channel, but I also like uploading different kinds of videos and attract different kind of subscribers. And in my name, it doesn't say any, like, it doesn't say Clash of Clans. My channel name is Bowser Cole, which is my Google account name. <laughs> Sorry, I would have picked something else, but that's what I named my Google account. And yeah, so if you guys want some Boom Beach, of course, just shoot down the comment section. I think you guys would maybe like a little Boom Beach. So, yeah, that raid is pretty good. We got some decent loot, and let's get on to our next attack. And as you can see, uh, this guy, uh, Erin, or... Yeah, I think Erin was his name. It, from, um, at at Erk. Well, I don't know how to say that. That looks like German or something. If you guys know what that says, the clan name is, then uh, please shoot it down in the comment section. I have absolutely no idea. <laughs> I have no idea. Um, so I'm getting that loot, you know, very simple. Just Barch is very good with, you know, getting that loot. I'm liking these full collector bases. So I'm going to be picking all these free buildings because in every single raid I go for 50%. Just to make sure I maintain my trophies. Because if I lose too many attacks, I'm going to lose trophies. So, my, so I don't try to lose any attacks. I always go for the one star and try to get all that loot. So, so far we're at 44% doing good. Um, 30 seconds left in the replay. I'm going to be taking out this king. And then I'm probably going to go for that uh, dark elixir right there. Because um, obviously I'm trying to upgrade my archer queen. And I need that dark elixir. She's pretty expensive. Uh, she is like 27,500. Which ain't cheap. Unless you maxed out the barbarian king at level at town hall 8. Uh. You probably haven't saved this much Dark Elixir. Or if you got the King of Ten of Tunnel 9, I don't know. My recommendation is get that Queen of Five ASAP. So, I got all that loot, and let's get into our next battle. And look at this loot. Pretty nice, you know, 250 of each. And look at the Dark Elixir, 2,000 Dark Elixir. I mean, I'm not, I don't find too many Town Hall 10s. You know, I'm not, at a, I'm not in, like, farming in Masters. Um, cause I'm just not high enough, leveled enough to farm in Masters. Maybe when I'm a little bit higher leveled, I'll go up in maybe Crystal 1 Masters area and just farm. But right now, um, I'm just farming in Gold 1. And yeah, so the Dark Elixir, I usually get around 200 or 8. I mean, like, these guys can get, like, I mean, like, I've seen, I've watched uh, White Lightning HWD. He gets, like, two, 3,000 Dark Elixir every attack. If I got that, I could probably farm my Archer Queen up, like, like, like like that 
If you heard my snap, yeah. Very fast. So, um, I, I got a lot of resources so far. There's still plenty left, and I'm gonna try to get that town hall. Because, um, obviously, I want to win this attack. And, um, if there's a free town hall, I always go for it. Or a town exposed town hall, I go for it. Because then I could focus 100% on the loot. Because that if you get it if you get the town hall you don't you don't lose the attack so then you could focus 100% on the loot and that's awesome so I got the town hall so I didn't lose this attack and now let's get this loot so so far we're 30 33 percent and I just hit 400 com four, 400 thousand combined resources and 600 dark which is really comes in handy and we still have two dark elixir drills yet to collect so. Let's see what we can do. So, so far around 37%. I'm going to be destroying this Archer Queen. So I can get some of that loot right there. Those two mines. And maybe even that Dark Elixir Drill right there. So I'm going to drop my Barbarian King over there. And my Archer Queen over here. My goal is to, for them to get the drills. I got my King on Iron Fist. This is why I want my Archer Queen on level 5. As you can see. Right now I could have hit that Cloak ability. And she could have gotten some, some hit points on that Drill. But that's alright. So I'm going to drop two lightning spells on this drill. So I can get more dark elixir. And then I'll drop two lightning spells on that elixir mine. Because that's all I had left. So I can get more loot. Look at that awesome attack. Crap load of loot. And now we're going to be attacking live. Um, so, I, I, so I need a little bit more gold for that wizard tower. So let's see how much gold we can get. So we're going to have like three live attacks in this video. So... This isn't an insane loot attack, but this is decent, and I'll take it. Not, you know, this isn't th f 500,000 of each. I wish it was. <laughs> but uh, this is decent, and you know what? I'll take it. My hope was to use as less as, like, the... And these waves where you don't get too much, you want to use, like, really, like, least amount of troops as possible. So, yeah. It kind of helps just because, you know, this is a quick, easy attack, but... I, I used a lot of my army just because I went for 50% because I really don't want to lose trophies It's just not worth it to lose trophies because then I'll have to if I mean if I, let's say I just got the loot and surrendered every attack I would drop maybe a good 200 trophies and then I'd probably have to push back up with some formal pushing strategy And I'm looking for resources not pushing so that's why I go for 50% So I pretty much got all that loot. I just got to get these two gold mines and then we got all that loot, and then I'll go for the one star. Because I do go for the win every attack to maintain my trophies. Um, I just don't like that. I don't want to lose my trophies. <laughs> Get what I'm saying? You know, you don't want to lose your trophies, especially if there's good loot. So I almost got all of that resources. We're at 43%. So we just have that Dark Elixir Drill. And then um, those uh, buildings right there, that's what I'm going to do. So we're at 46%. Two buildings can get the job done. A few more barbarians. Um, they're going to take out that drill. 48%. And I see that builder hut, and that builder hut is perfect. So I drop like two barbarians, three archers, and that builder hut goes down. I surrender. Oh, sorry, someone just texted me. And yeah, let's get into our next attack. So I actually recorded a second clip because I didn't get enough gold. So guess what, guys? It's time to be a douchebag. Alright, ready? <laughs> Alright, let's put our Archer Queen on the Town Hall. And let's drop these lightning spells on the Dark Elixir. <laughs> I love doing this. And, and then we just gained a crap load of Dark Elixir a lot. And that's going to come in handy. And we're just going to let our Archer Queen do her thing and take out that Town Hall. Um, I do do this sometimes, hashtag why not, and it's kind of funny, <laughs> and um, I like getting Dark Elixir, you know, pretty quickly, because I want to get my Archer Queen up, because people are going to go for my Dark Elixir, and I'd rather not get stu- because today I actually got stolen 300,000 gold, and that's a lot, so here's our next attack, and um, he has a crap load of resources, 275,000 gold, 230,000 Elixir, 481 dark elixir that's gonna come in handy if we can get it all and now we're gonna deploy some barbarians and archers on these mines and this is drill because I really want to get this dark elixir because every drop counts 
I need, how much was it like? I need like 6,000 more Dark Elixir. If, <laughs> if I can, you know, find some decent raids and I lightning spell a few Dark Elixir storages. Um, I could do, you know, I can get my Archer Queen up. Hopefully by, in the next few days, I can get my Queen up. Hopefully before our next war, because obviously every, if you know, my war strategy is go wipe. That means I spend around 2,000 Dark Elixir per war, 1,000 a raid. And that's freaking expensive, especially when you're trying to upgrade your Archer Queen. I do it, of course, so we can win the war. Obviously, I don't really care. But, yeah. So I want to get this Archer Queen up. Man, I got texted again. Sorry. <laughs> Ignore these texting. Sorry. Um, I'm at 37% and we're going to go for the win. So we got pretty much all of that loot. So I'm going to be clearing these outside buildings. 38%. We're almost at 40%. There we go. We just hit 40%. We're getting close. And that king is going to go down few barbarians on these on this camp and on this uh king pedestal thingy mabob so now we're gonna just deploy the rest of our armies our barbarians and our barbarian king all our archers and our archer queen so um here we go i just um iron fisted my king and we hit the 50 percent and i get out of there and we got some nice loot with that pretty good bonus and yeah so let's check out how much resources we have we almost have enough for our queen and we have enough for our wizard tower to go to level six and yeah so i hope you guys enjoyed like comment subscribe and i'll see you soon peace out